Hello, 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 hello. I'm Lynn Browner, and I have a son, Owen, who is 11, and he has autism. We paint together. He helps me paint the backgrounds of our paintings, and then I paint the rest. And right now, we are going to experiment. <laughs> I laugh because I think almost every one of my paintings is still an experiment. <laughs> um, I'm, you know, learning still. I don't know that I'll ever say that I'm officially learned on up. <laughs> um, but that's, that's part of the, the fun of it. That's part of, you know, why I paint. I, I started painting because I was wanting to paint with Owen, but that's kind of quickly, um, turned to, you know, I paint for me and, um, from there we figure it out and we go and do and be and see and <laughs> all the other things. So those are technically like two different oranges, but that does not really look very different. But that is a different one. So, um, I'm making some blobs and as you can see, um, flowers, because, you know, I do a lot of flowers. Um, and if you've watched before, you know, a lot of times I say I like to watch paint dry. And I really like to watch paint dry. Because this is kind of a, a aqua-ish color background. And so I like to see what things, when you, when it dries, what it's actually going to look like on there. So that's my story and I'm sticking to it. But what I'm doing right now is going through and making flower dots. And then I'm going to go back in once they've dried for a second. See, and I don't care that they're all over the place because, you know, oops, I didn't want to do that. I had a separate brush for the orange and now I have a blue brush and a orange brush that's mixed. And it doesn't matter because we'll go back and do something different. Um, but it, that was not the plan. The plan was to have my colors. Uh, and again, it, like, you know, I, I'll eventually be probably mixing them more than that, but that's the way the ball bounces. I think this needs a big uh, tealy one. More tealy one, something like that. And then one more of these. And I'm going to attempt to put a little more color in these ones that it quickly faded into the background, which is again fine. Um, I figure it's going to anyways, because, you know, this, the color, um, but this is where the next part of our lives is coming together. <laughs> the plan is coming together. Um, I don't do a lot of little tiny detail work because I generally, I have a tiny bit of a shake. And so a lot of times I just, I don't really, um, 
try to do straight lines or anything, but I'm just going to kind of go in here and do accented like stuff. And so it'll be okay because I'm not really going in a particular fashion or order. Um, I'm just kind of dotting around. And, you know, so what if we make a... <laughs> we just paint over it or change. Um, one of the things that I do a lot of is put way, 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 way too much paint on my paintbrush. That causes um, me to drop a lot of paint. And so, because of that, um, a lot of times I do what I call little sprinkles, and I just keep adding um, color all around, you know, by, I take the paintbrush and I'll hit it, and it drops the, the paint around. Um, so, you know, that one's not as dry because I'd added that extra so I'm going to go back over that one in a minute and again there's no rules we're just making you know kind of these are um, maybe a little more abstract flowers than I generally do um, but you know not very abstract. As many styles of flowers are out there, I'm sure. Um, it's something similar somewhere. I'll leave that one again because it's there's a couple of them that I added that extra stuff to. So. They're kind of like, um, kind of like roses, kind of not, kind of like, I don't know, we can guess what kind of flowers they are. So Owen had today off, it's, um, it's a holiday, and um, he, they, they're hard, they're just, all holidays are hard, all days breaks in days are hard. And so today was hard. And we went out to breakfast with um, my parents, his grandma, grandma, grandma. And who doesn't love to spend time with your grandma? I loved. I miss, miss mine extremely. But he, um, you know, he's holding on to all of those moments. Like, he doesn't want to miss time. And it's so hard on him when it's not routine. And this is anything but routine because he's not in school. And so, um, it's just hard. And so, we went out to breakfast. And then, um, he was possibly going to go to, um, my parents today. But that then was causing some other moments and it was just too much. Um, he just was getting upset and I didn't want him even more upset. So we went out to breakfast and then, um, we came back home and he is ready for his day tomorrow, which is Saturday. And he gets to usually go spend 
that with his grandma again um, on his regular weeks when he's in school. So he's looking forward to that. Um, but it's just so hard when routine is anything but routine. So hopefully he can go with his grandma tomorrow. Hopefully according to plan. And all will be happy again. Um, but he just... Oh, I feel so bad for him because he can't figure out, you know, why he's not in school and why he's not with his friends or why, you know, things are not what he thinks they should be. So that's just hard. It's just completely hard. But, um, you know, we'll survive and he'll thrive. It's just getting him to understand that things aren't always exactly the same and he does so well with routine and so it's something completely off routine and I think I shouldn't have added all these green <laughs> oh well um it was probably better simplistic since this was kind of a little bit wild to begin with but well you know once you get some green in there you gotta do all the green I guess so hopefully tomorrow he will go spend time with his grandma and it'll be all better again so I always do O for Owen and then L and B so there is that and uh this is my colors, so I just um, spread this all out because I uh, make, I'll do it a little bit better, but um, I make, oh, I like write painting on myself over here. Not that it's any different than what I'm already doing because, you know, I've already got paint, but um, tons of little crafts and things with the leftover paint. So I just spread this all out and then it takes a couple days and it dries and then I can pull it off of the parchment paper and put it onto the jewelry and different things. So that's what that is. All right. Well, thank you for watching and being a part of our day. Toodles, toodles.